Hi everybody, Susie Fido here from Marketing with Ethics. And in this week's Marketing Munch, I'm gonna show you how to create a slideshow video for use on your Facebook business page. Some of you may be asking, why would you want to create a slideshow video? As we all know, video has become huge on social media and Facebook is no different. It gives fantastic reach for any kind of video content and creating a slideshow video actually means you can just have still images that you put together and then it ranks it the same as it would a video. The images you can create on free software online like canva.com, um, I personally use Photoshop, or you can get someone to create them for you. But I'm gonna show you today how you can actually create them. Very simple, so we'll go over to the Marketing with Ethics page. And we're on the Marketing with Ethics page here, and you simply select the first option, share a photo or video. Now you've probably shared photos or videos as individuals up to now. You're quite used to seeing this and it's usually the top one, but just scroll down and click on create a slideshow. As you can see, you can add three to 10 photos to create a video. And then once you're on here, you've got different options available. So you've got original, square, rectangle or vertical. Now I'm gonna leave it on original because I have set them to the standard pixel size for Facebook already. You can then set the image duration from anything to half a second up to five seconds per image. Now statistics have shown that three seconds is the perfect sort of timing. It's long enough for people to actually read anything you've put on the picture, but not too long that they actually get bored. And again, fading each image out in between is a great option. And then you simply just go down and click on the plus. If you haven't got your images there already, you just simply upload the images. Now I've created some here ready, so I've got seven images there. I'm gonna add them in. And as you can see, it's populating the images in the bottom here. You can then also set music and be careful when you're adding music, especially if you're uploading your own, because there are certain copyright licenses, but there are a lot of free options already on here on Facebook that you can choose from. And then you simply click on create slideshow. Now you've got your slideshow here. You're obviously gonna to want to add some text and potentially a link through to whatever it is that you're advertising. So I've already written some just to make things a bit quicker. If you are doing a link through to something, make sure you have the link at the very top because you are limited with how many characters show. So you want it at the top and then again at the bottom. And then you simply click on publish or you can schedule it. So if we go ahead and publish and then I'll refresh the page. And here we go. And you'll get a notification saying your video upload is now ready. So as you can see, here we go. And there's the video. There's the information where they can click. You can then boost your post so you can actually reach out to other people other than just your followers. And another great thing is you can actually add captions to make it easier for people to watch your video without any sound. And they do increase the engagement and watch time. And to do so, you can simply click on generate and you can choose at what point you want any captions added in. And you simply click and type what you want and click save to video. So this is a great way to add extra information into the video itself. If you want to add additional call to actions. I've already got wording on the images, so I won't add that. This is a great option if you have any special offers or anything like that on. What you can also do is actually pin the post to the top of your page, so it's the first thing that people see. To pin the post, you simply click on the down arrow and pin to top of page. And what will happen is that will then stay as your top post, regardless of any other posts added. And you can see that by the pinned sign there. So there you go, that's this week's Marketing Munch on how to create a slideshow video to advertise or promote a product or service.